Jedi Dad 1971 here, Red Dead Story. Gonna talk to Trelawney and see what he's got. Well, I know you think I'm just some effete buffoon. What? A man of words and not of action. Hardly a man at all. Well, I think you're as slippery as an eel in an oil slick, but still a man. Because I think I've I found something interesting. Yeah? Have you ever robbed a stagecoach? No. I would have even thought. Of course, I robbed a goddamn stagecoach. You know I have. And what's the problem with stagecoaches? The armed man attempting to put a bullet in your head. Not quite. The odds. I mean, is it worth the robbing? Sometimes. I know. But, well, if you'd like to come with me, I can introduce you to a new best friend, and he's he's going to give you all the. Decent, robbable stagecoaches a hot blooded degenerate could require. Well, I could require a whole lot. What's going on, the wrong freaking horse? So, where do we find this friend of yours? Roads. Because what can possibly go wrong there? Well, lead the way and we'll find out. Lead the way to Rhodes. I've done my part. Each to their strengths, dear boy. You know. You boys should really watch yourselves with those two families. This is a small town. People talk. I tried to mention it to Osea, but you know how he is. Anyway, while they're off chasing that pot of Confederate gold hidden at the end of some rainbow, here we are. We can hitch up outside. I'll make the introductions, Arthur. Okay. Josiah, how have you been? Dandy. And you, friend? Uh, like I said, times are tough. My missus is a bad woman. Terrible woman. They often are. But how's work, Alden? Terrible. Wages got cut again. They reckon they just invented a new horse's carriage will be the end of us. <laughs> They've been saying that nonsense since they invented the wheel. The whip this of bosses. I know. My comrades here and I are greatly discouraged from the adequate fulfillment of our duty. A discouraged man is no man at all, Alden. No man at all. My friend Arthur here has a present for you. Dear. Ain't you kind, sir? Call him Arthur. He's one of us, a fellow man of distinction. Okay, well, this is perfect timing. I think you'll like this one, Josiah. It'll be coming south the river road through Siltwater Strand. Thank you, Alden. Thank you very much. Oh, and Josiah, if you or Arthur are ever out Strawberry Way, ask for my colleague there, a feller called Hector. He's also one of the... What did you call us again? Discouraged men, Alden. That's it, discouraged men. I like that. Well, goodbye, Alden, or should I say, adieu. Oh, adieu, Josiah. What the hell was that? I thought you might like to see that pantomime. River Road through Siltwater Strand, he said. Okay. I think I know a good spot to wait. Follow me. Okay. Yep, strange remissions from the post office, like it online. Good. Okay, let's go. This way. See, fast travel grayed out. Well, it is grayed out for Arthur until I did. That thing for his camp or whatever so he can fast travel. 
But while on missions online, you can't fast travel. What did I tell you? Simple as can be. Seems a lot of the station workers are in on it these days. Earning a pittance, the unions are whipping them up, so they want something on the side. Like he said, there, Strawberry, could create a lot of opportunities for a man in your line of work. I ain't sure about going back to Strawberry after all that market business. It didn't sound like you left anyone alive to recognize you, so I wouldn't worry too much, dear boy. All this trouble, you gentlemen are becoming quite the celebrities, aren't you? Soon you'll be on the front of a dime novel. And dead, of course. We're hoping to be long gone before that. Dutch has a plan. If anything goes wrong, let's meet back here at this crossroad, okay? All right. Here we are. This is the spot. Okay. This should do. Sure. Here. I'm hoping we won't need those. Better safe than sorry. So what were you thinking? Well, according to this, the loot is located in a strong box, which is in the back. I'll put on a little performance, and you can scurry around, open the strong box, and relieve them of their goodies. And how do I open the strong box without threatening someone to open it for me? This should work. <laughs> and I can do this silently? Well, I'm hoping Lockpick. complete silence won't <coughs> be necessary. But you're going to wish you had your earplugs. This is... Samson. Oh, very good, Alden. Very good. Of course, if anything goes wrong, you can wave your guns around like you normally do. Hold tight. They'll be here soon. There it is. Right on time. They don't work Let's online. Go. Keep your distance so it's so a waste of money to buy. And please leave that gun in its holster for once. That gun in its holster. back so Just sold her on a fake show. So sorry, gentlemen, for the interruption. Farewell. Well done, 
done, sir. Well done. It was easy. You did all the work. Teamwork, my dear boy. Teamwork. There you go. Thank you. Oh, it's only good. Go see Alden from time to time. See you soon, Arthur. Mission complete. You all right, girl? And there goes, you know, the stranger missions with Alden and the other post office guys in the world of Red Dead Online. This is Jedi Dad 1971. Like, comment, subscribe. I greatly appreciate it, and it helped me out a lot. And I'll see everybody on the next part. So long.